In the grand tapestry of life, we often encounter moments when we feel disrespected, unappreciated, or even scorned by others. The human experience is rife with these challenging situations, but how we respond to disrespect can define the course of our lives. In this video of Stoicism, we'll delve into the timeless wisdom of Marcus Aurelius and other Stoic philosophers to reveal 10 Stoic lessons to handle disrespect. These lessons will provide you with the tools and perspectives necessary to navigate disrespect with grace, resilience, and wisdom. This guide is designed to be both informative and inspirational, helping you understand the 10 Stoic lessons to handle disrespect and apply them to your life. Let's embark on this journey of self-discovery, guided by the wisdom of Marcus Aurelius and the Stoics. Accept the nature of humanity. Disrespect is a reflection of the imperfections inherent in human nature. To handle it effectively, we must first embrace the stoic lesson of accepting the nature of humanity. People are imperfect beings, driven by their own desires, biases, and emotions. They may act in ways that are unkind, rude, or disrespectful. However, the stoics teach us that it is not the actions of others that define us, but our response to those actions. Marcus Aurelius, in his Meditations, reminds us that like a promontory standing against the unrelenting waves, we can remain resolute in the face of disrespect. To do so, we must recognize that human imperfections are universal and that we too are not exempt from moments of imperfection. 1. Reflect on your own imperfections and past moments when you may have acted in a less than ideal manner. 2. Understand that disrespect often stems from the ignorance or emotional turmoil of others, and it is not a true reflection of your worth. 3. Cultivate empathy and compassion toward those who disrespect you, recognizing that they, too, are navigating the complexities of human existence. By accepting the nature of humanity, you can detach yourself from the emotional impact of disrespect and maintain your inner peace. Cultivate inner virtue. When faced with disrespect, our initial instinct might be to respond in kind, seeking revenge or retaliation. However, the Stoics guide us toward a higher path, one of cultivating inner virtue. This lesson reminds us that our character and integrity should not be compromised by the disrespectful actions of others. Marcus Aurelius wisely advises that the best way to respond to disrespect is not by mirroring the behavior of our detractors, but by rising above it. This involves maintaining our own virtuous character and not allowing external negativity to corrupt our inner selves. 1. Prioritize your values and principles. Determine the kind of person you want to be and the virtues you hold dear, such as honesty, kindness, and integrity. 2. Refrain from engaging in disrespectful behavior in retaliation. This only perpetuates a cycle of negativity. 3. Let your actions and character be a testament to your values and integrity, serving as a quiet but powerful response to disrespect. In cultivating inner virtue, you not only rise above the disrespectful actions of others, but also inspire those around you with your unwavering commitment to living a principled life. Focus on what's within your control. One of the fundamental teachings of Stoicism is the concept of the dichotomy of control which divides the world into two categories, things within our control and things beyond our control. Disrespect, often arising from the actions and opinions of others, falls into the latter category. 1. Recognize that the behavior and opinions of others are external to you and beyond your control. 2. Shift your focus to what you can control, your own thoughts, actions, and responses. Three. Concentrate on cultivating virtues, maintaining inner peace, and responding to disrespect with grace and wisdom. By embracing the dichotomy of control, you free yourself from the burden of trying to change the unchangeable and redirect your energy towards personal growth and self-improvement. Practice detachment from external events. In the face of disrespect, the stoic lesson of detachment from external events is a powerful tool. By practicing this lesson, you can shield yourself from the emotional turmoil that disrespectful actions or words may trigger. 1. Cultivate the habit of self-reflection and self-awareness. 
Spend time in your own company to understand your thoughts and emotions. 2. Learn to observe external events, such as disrespect, without immediately reacting emotionally. 3. Consider the impermanence of external circumstances and the fleeting nature of others' opinions. By practicing detachment from external events, you can maintain your composure and prevent disrespectful incidents from negatively affecting your inner tranquility. Use adversity as an opportunity. Stoicism teaches us to view adversity as an opportunity for growth and self-improvement. In the face of disrespect, we can apply this lesson by transforming the challenges posed by disrespectful actions into stepping stones for personal development. Marcus Aurelius encourages us to embrace obstacles and view them as a means to advance our character and actions. Disrespect, rather than being a hindrance, can become a catalyst for self-improvement. 1. When faced with disrespect, view it as an obstacle that can be overcome and used to your advantage. 2. Identify the lessons you can learn from the experience and the virtues you can cultivate in response. 3. Use adversity as a source of motivation to become a better, more resilient person. By adopting this perspective, you can turn moments of disrespect into opportunities for personal. Maintain equanimity in the face of disrespect. The stoic lesson of maintaining equanimity reminds us that the company we keep and the influence of others can significantly impact our responses to disrespect. It's essential to surround ourselves with individuals who uplift and inspire us rather than those who bring negativity into our lives. Epictetus teaches us the importance of choosing our associations wisely, emphasizing that the presence of positive, virtuous individuals can help us maintain our composure when confronted with disrespect. This lesson encourages us to seek out people who align with our values and contribute to our emotional well-being. 1. Evaluate your social circle and assess the influence of those around you. Consider distancing yourself from toxic or negative relationships. 2. Seek out companions and friends who embody the virtues you admire and can provide emotional support when facing disrespect. 3. Surround yourself with individuals who encourage your growth, self-improvement, and the practice of stoic principles. By maintaining equanimity through positive associations, you can bolster your resilience and fortify yourself against the impact of disrespect. Silence can be the loudest response. In moments of disrespect, it can be tempting to respond with words or actions. However, the stoic lesson here suggests that silence can often be the most powerful and dignified response. This is not silence out of weakness, but a deliberate choice to maintain inner tranquility and not be drawn into unnecessary conflict. Epictetus reminds us that harm from disrespect occurs not from the external action itself, but from our perception and emotional reaction to it. By maintaining composure and responding with silence, we deny disrespectful behavior the power to provoke us. 1. When confronted with disrespect, take a moment to pause and breathe. Avoid impulsive reactions. 2. Reflect on the nature of the disrespect and whether responding is truly necessary or beneficial. 3. Choose silence as a response when it helps you maintain your inner peace and dignity. By practicing this stoic lesson, you can cultivate emotional resilience and demonstrate the strength of your character through dignified silence. Reflect on the transitory nature of life. Stoicism teaches us to reflect on the transitory nature of life. In the grand scheme of history, empires have risen and fallen, and individuals have come and gone. Disrespect, as a fleeting event, should not be allowed to disrupt our inner equilibrium. Marcus Aurelius encourages us to look at the broader perspective of human existence and the inevitable changes and fluctuations that occur. When faced with disrespect, this lesson helps us maintain our emotional balance by recognizing the impermanence of the situation. One. Contemplate the transient nature of life and history. Consider how the current moment will pass into the annals of the past. 2. Recognize that, in the grand scheme of things, disrespect is a minor and temporary event. 3. Focus on the enduring values and principles that guide your life, rather than the ephemeral emotions provoked by disrespect. By reflecting on the transitory nature of life, 
You can find solace and perspective when confronted with disrespect. Seek understanding and compassion. Disrespect often stems from misunderstanding, ignorance, or the struggles of others. The stoic lesson of seeking understanding and compassion reminds us that responding to disrespect with kindness and empathy can be a powerful means of diffusing tension and fostering positive change. 1. When faced with disrespect, take a moment to consider the possible motivations or struggles of the person disrespecting you. 2. Approach the situation with a mindset of understanding and a genuine desire to help, if appropriate. 3. Respond with kindness and modesty, as these qualities often lead to the resolution of conflicts and the growth of positive relationships. By seeking understanding and compassion, you can transform disrespectful encounters into opportunities for growth, connection, and the demonstration of stoic virtues. Embrace stoic resilience. The final stoic lesson in handling disrespect is to embrace stoic resilience. Just as sailors become skilled through navigating turbulent waters, we can become stronger and wiser through facing and overcoming challenges. Disrespect, rather than being a setback, can be an opportunity for personal growth and character development. This part encourages us to approach life's challenges with a spirit of resilience and fortitude. One. View disrespect as an opportunity to test and strengthen your stoic principles, virtues, and resilience. 2. Embrace the challenges presented by disrespectful encounters as moments for personal growth and self-improvement. 3. Remember that resilience is not the absence of difficulty, but the ability to bounce back and continue your journey with determination and wisdom. By embracing stoic resilience, you can transform moments of disrespect into stepping stones on your path toward living a virtuous, purposeful, and meaningful life. In the grand symphony of life, disrespect is but a passing note. The stoic teachings, as exemplified by the wisdom of Marcus Aurelius and other stoic philosophers, offer us a timeless and invaluable guide for navigating these moments with grace and resilience. 1. Accept the nature of humanity and detach ourselves from the actions of others. 2. Cultivate inner virtue and be a beacon of integrity in the face of disrespect. 3. Focus on what's within our control and let go of the rest. 4. Practice detachment from external events and find inner peace. 5. Use adversity as an opportunity for growth. 6. Maintain equanimity through positive associations. 7. Recognize the power of dignified silence as a response to disrespect. 8. Reflect on the transitory nature of life and find solace in the bigger picture. 9. Seek understanding and compassion as a means of diffusing tension. 10. Embrace stoic resilience and view challenges as opportunities for growth. In your journey towards mastering these stoic lessons, remember that it is not the absence of disrespect, but your response to it that defines your character. With the wisdom of the Stoics as your guide, you have the tools to lead a life characterized by inner peace, virtue, and purpose. Gratitude helps us maintain perspective and focus on the positive aspects of our existence. It can be a shield against the negativity that disrespect may bring. By appreciating what we have and the virtues we embody, we can better weather the storms of disrespect. 1. Regularly take time to reflect on the things in your life that you're grateful for, including the virtues you possess. 2. When confronted with disrespect, remind yourself of the blessings and virtues you hold dear. 3. Use gratitude as a source of strength and resilience, allowing it to uplift your spirit even in the face of negativity. By embracing gratitude, you not only handle disrespect more effectively, but you also enrich your life with a deeper sense of contentment and fulfillment. As we conclude our exploration of these 10 Stoic lessons to handle disrespect, it's essential to recognize that Stoicism is not a quick fix solution to the challenges we face in life. It's a lifelong journey, a path toward personal growth, self-mastery, and a fulfilling existence. These Stoic teachings, anchored in the wisdom of Marcus Aurelius and other Stoic philosophers, offer us a guiding light, 
They empower us to confront the inevitable instances of disrespect with grace, dignity, and resilience. They show us that, even in the face of adversity, we can lead a life characterized by inner peace, virtue, and purpose. He'll also find strength in dignified silence, seek understanding and compassion, and embrace stoic resilience in the face of adversity. These lessons serve as tools in your toolkit helping you craft a life that is both fulfilling and resilient. In your pursuit of these stoic ideals, remember that it's entirely human to face challenges and moments of disrespect. The stoics didn't promise a life without adversity, but rather provided a philosophy that equipped you to handle such challenges with wisdom and grace. As you continue to integrate these stoic lessons into your life, you will find that the disrespect of others need not diminish your inner peace. Instead, it can be an opportunity to demonstrate your character and grow as an individual. You will become, in the words of Marcus Aurelius, like the promontory against which the waves continually break, but it stands firm and tames the fury of the water around it. So carry these stoic lessons with you, like a trusted compass guiding you through the storms of life. As you do, you will discover the power to transform disrespect into an opportunity for growth and your journey will be marked by resilience, virtue, and an enduring sense of inner peace. In the words of the Stoics, remember that the key to a fulfilling life is not in changing the world, but in changing yourself, in cultivating the virtues of wisdom, courage, justice, and temperance. These virtues will not only help you navigate the challenges of disrespect, but will also serve as a beacon, guiding you toward a life of purpose and meaning. With the wisdom of the Stoics, particularly Marcus Aurelius, as your companion, you are equipped to embrace life's challenges with open arms, to see adversity as an opportunity for growth, and to find strength in the face of disrespect. As you tread this path, you will find that the Stoic lessons provide not only a way to handle disrespect, but a profound guide to leading a good and virtuous life. Embrace these teachings, practice them with diligence, and allow them to become an integral part of your character. In doing so, you will discover that Stoicism is not merely a philosophy but a way of life, one that offers the promise of enduring peace, inner strength, and the capacity to handle disrespect with grace, dignity, and wisdom. So go forth with these Stoic lessons in your heart, and may your journey be marked by a deep sense of fulfillment and resilience. Remember the words of Marcus Aurelius, who urged us to live out your life in truth and justice, tolerant of those who are neither true nor just. By doing so, you honor the timeless wisdom of the Stoics and make the world a better place, one person at a time.